Yeah, so I'm Tech Sergeant Devin Notstein. Um, I'm a combat camera craftsman um, here at the first combat camera squadron. So Exercise Green Goblin is uh, it's an annual exercise that we conduct here at the First Combat Camera Squadron uh, to really test uh, and hone our skill sets in no light and low light conditions so that we can provide that um, basically like the you're here kind of perspective to DOD and joint leaders. Our cadre, uh, we plan these exercises like months in advance so that we can kind of provide the most realistic training experience that we can. Um, so we kind of try to walk, work through like a walk, a crawl, walk, run phase. Um, so there's gonna be some classroom stuff uh, where they're gonna learn um, different things from experts that have been out in the field. Then they're gonna actually get their hands on the equipment uh, where the cadre work and give like instant feedback um, while they're doing different like sensitive site exploitation um, workflow um, different things with evidence collection under red light conditions. And then lastly, uh, what we're really excited about is integrating with EOD. Um, so those teammates are going to come over here, embed with our ComCam team, and then uh, they're going to ruck to a different location and go through some of these exercises uh, that we're going to actually go through earlier in the week. So uh, it's going to be really exciting. Uh, hopefully they enjoy it, you know, and, and don't, you know, uh, don't really have a bad time, you know. So uh, at the first, we provide senior DOD and joint leaders uh, that directed imagery capability in support of strategic, operational, and planning requirements, um, which basically means that we acquire still and motion imagery um, in support of air, sea, and ground military operations. And since military operations don't stop when the sun goes down, uh, we have to ensure that every single member of our team is a technical expert in those no light and low light conditions uh, so that we can actually provide those, uh, that imagery, whether it's historical record or if it's battlefield assessment. So that's why we conduct exercises like Green Goblin. Uh, it's, it's necessary um, and it's definitely important for our team members. Sweet. So in expeditionary environments, we aren't really granted the opportunity to take our time to think through challenges. Uh, it kind of has to be like second nature, right? Um, so these kinds of exercises kind of put us in that mindset to where we're not only flexing like our skills, um, but we're flexing our mental capacity uh, to be able to process stressful situations. So we can see what's happening in front of us, assess it quickly, um, react correctly, and then provide that imagery that we need to do.